the 2024-2025 school year is in full swing and there's so much to talk about. My name is Feather, a senior at Glen High School. And I'm Dalton, also a senior at Glen High School. We missed you all so much and hope you had a nice and relaxing summer. Now, without further ado, let's highlight some of the great things going on across the one LISD community. We want to start by bragging about one of our awesome elementary schools that just recently earned their recertification as a leader in Mead Lighthouse School. Reed Elementary was awarded their recertification for continuing to show growth and innovation within the Leader in Me framework. Reed's principal at the time, Paige Coyer, went on to say, I'm incredibly proud to lead this school and witness the leadership potential of each and every learner in our community. The Lighthouse Recertification Review is an assessment for schools to reflect and celebrate their accomplishments since receiving their original certification. Along with Reed, Rutledge, and Westside Elementary Schools are also certified Lighthouse house schools. Out of the hundreds of thousands of schools across the country, another one of our elementary schools is being noticed for their hard work. That's right. Blockhouse Creek Elementary was recognized for their model of professional learning community at work by Solution Tree. Their PLCs are constantly going above and beyond to make sure there is a focus on learning while building a collaborative culture that helps create positive results from their students. Only 600 schools were ever given this distinction. Thank you, Bears, for continuing to find new ways to help our learners be the force of the future. Now, to one of our educators who is being recognized for her kindness, positivity, and overall good vibes. Denise Geiger was honored with the Sunshine Education Award by Hill Country Community Ministries at a recent ceremony. She serves as the Senior Coordinator of Special Education Transition Services while also being a board member for LEAF. Just from those last few sentences, you can tell how devoted she is to providing education to those seeking more of it. Congratulations on the well-deserved award. This may sound biased coming from a couple soon-to-be journalists, but I think Leander ISD has some of the best journalism teachers around. And I'm not just saying that because our teacher is watching us record this. I agree. And so does the Journalism Education Association. They recently named Rouse High School's Shelby Nichols as one of their rising stars. She is currently the newspaper and yearbook advisor at Rouse. And might I add, their yearbook replay was a CSPA gold medalist last year. From one journalist program to another, we want to congratulate you on a job well done. There is a new president in the ranks of the Texas High School Coaches Association. Coach Drew Sanders at Van de Grift was elected by his peers to be the president-elect. He will play a key role in discussions involving UIL policy and Texas legislature topics. Among other initiatives to possibly impact coaches across the state and the student athletes they will serve. He will begin his term in 2025. We're not even a month into the school year and we're already off to a great start. Yes, we can't wait to see what we're all able to accomplish this year. Never forget, we're all one community. One family. One, one LISD. LISD.